realizing that you've probably got more music tracks than video tracks to watch or listen to, um, the Arcos 605 has a music player built in. So all you do is press the screen, it loads up the music information, and all the everything's listed here from artist to title to genre. A really nice one is year, so if you've got the track information of when the album was created, it will sort everything into there. And then you can also create some playlists and ratings so you can play your favorite music. Accessing the songs is quite easy. It's just a case of pressing the title information, for example, and then that will go through and list the titles of the songs that are listed. You can then select the track you want. There's some album cover art, taking very much from Apple's uh, leaf there. And um, pressing OK, you get the screen and it plays away and it tells you all the useful information of who the artist is, the track, the number, the song, the album. Uh, which songs are next, which songs are before. And it's, you know, a nice, sort of very easy to use interface for getting music. Now, moving on, we have photos, which again, taking advantage of this massive screen, allows you to upload your photos onto the drive. Now, this unit comes with 30 gigs of storage space, uh, which will give you quite a lot of photos if you wanted just photos or a combination of music, photos and video. There are larger sizes available for you if you're a real media hound and you have lots of footage, photos, music, films, etc. that you want to take around with you. All you can do is again sort everything via albums. You can stream via this network UPMP. You can stream uh, photos from your wireless network or from a, a network that you're you're connected to, so if you, you know, ideal for presentations perhaps in office, if you, if you need an excuse to buy this on business. And okay, again, it's just a case of selecting the button to uh, the picture. You can see the quality is really good. And then very much like the Apple iPhone, you can scroll your finger across to pull up the next picture. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. And you can go either way and then rotate the pictures around if you, if you want to by doing all these different fingers, finger motions on the screen. Of course, as with before, you can choose just to uh, use the buttons if you're, uh, if you're worried about wearing your fingertips out. So what do we think of the Arcos 605? Well, if this was the only product in the world, then we'd love it, it'd be brilliant. It's got a fantastic screen, you've got the Wi-Fi, the videos are quick to play, the music's that quick to play, the, the, the touchscreen controls are great, the extra buttons in case the touchscreen controls don't work are even better, but, and here's the big but, when this was launched in June, it was cutting edge. It was, you know, top of the pack, the flagship, the brilliantness of it all. And then Apple launched the iPod, the new touchscreen iPod, and its touchscreen controls. And it's, it's Apple, and they have this wonderful way of doing this sort of shininess to it all that makes you just want to buy that instead of this. And that's the big problem, is that if you hate Apple, and there are some people that do, and I know who you are, well, I don't personally, but you know who you are, then this is a great model to choose for, and this is you know, one that you're going to like, and you're going to use, and you're going to enjoy. The, the, the only other downside that we can find is that there wasn't that much content in the, in the content portal. But I think that's just an early days thing and there's probably going to be more stuff to come. But if you like Apple or if you're intrigued by Apple, then to be honest, the, the new touchscreen iPod is, is what you're going to want. It's sexy, it's shiny, it's lovely. And that's, that's going to be the biggest problem for Arcos coming forwards. So do we like it? Yes, we do. Is it the best out there? No, it's not, unfortunately. It was, but then by the time this has come out and will come out in the next week or so, then there's all going to be ready, a competition out there that's going to be bigger, better, and more, more sexy. And that's the big problem. But overall, it's, up, it's a thumbs up. So that's it for Megawalk this week. Hope you've enjoyed the show. Why don't you tune in next time for the lowdown on the latest piece of kit from the world of technology and gadgets. This is Megawalk TV. Thanks for watching. <laughs>